Hello, leaders of community agencies and valuable stakeholders to Galesburg Community District 205. My name is Jakara Kelly, and I'm an 11th grader at Galesburg High School, but depending on when you see this, I will be a rising senior. The end of the school year has been a very trying time for us all. And today, I have come to you to talk about the work that District 205 has embarked upon to respond to the difficulties that we, the students, now face. The district is working to focus on improving the social and emotional learning, also known as SEL, of the district's students and staff. You may have noticed that recently, the district's admi administrators and various other staff members have been making a more concerted effort to reinforce this important work. And recently, an SEL, an SEL steering committee has been formed by Ms. Mindy Ritchie, one of the assistant principals at Galesburg High School. The committee includes representatives from each building in our district and is working to embed social and emotional learning in all areas of our district and education. Their first order of business is to develop a vision statement to bring to you, and that is what I'm here right now to ask for your help on. You can do your part by responding to the short survey that has been sent to you, which looks like this. Please respond with your email and then answer or respond or answer and answer, sorry, to the potential uh, to the questions concerning the potential vision statement, which is District 205 provides a strong foundation of tools for students, staff, and families to be empathetic and resilient lifelong learners who per persevere in achieving their dreams. Please respond to these following questions. What do you love about this potential vision statement? What is missing from the potential vision statement? And please note anything that you think would make it stronger. Is there anything specific that schools provided your child that you would recommend the schools continue? What do students need to be successful in terms of SEL in school? What changes would you like to see in the way schools implement social and emotional learning? And finally, what suggestions or co concerns do you have for supporting students socially and emotionally during this remote learning time period? Remember, you can contact Ms. Mindy Ritchie at M-R-I-T-C-H-I-E or M Ritchie at galesburg205.org if you wish to serve as a representative on the SEL steering committee upon their uh the end of their development thank you so much for your time have a good day